Only on 12 tonight, Fox 12's Most Wanted assaulted a man with a baseball bat while he was walking his dog. And this happened in Cascade Logs, and the Hood River County Sheriff's Office says this was a random attack. Investigators don't know who did it or why. Fox 12's Audrey Wheel spoke with the man who was hit as he recovers at home. It's not the kind of thing you'd think would happen in Cascade Locks. My front door used to be, if you knew me and you knew I was home, come on in. Brenda Johnston and her husband, Ray Vitter, like living in a small city and sticking to their routine. Every eight hours, we're out walking the dog. But one of those early morning walks turned violent Thursday. Just all of a sudden, bam. The Hood River County Sheriff's Office says someone hit Vitter in the head with a baseball bat twice. I got up and then he hit me here sending him to the hospital with a concussion. Now he has 12 staples in his head and six stitches in his ear. Just terrible. Why would somebody do something like that? Why would they hit him? Why? He didn't do anything. I just, just started yelling and cursing and things not fit for the air. And he turned around and ran off. Deputies say it was random. They don't know who did it or why. They're investigating a few unrelated crimes here these past couple weeks, but say overall there hasn't been any sort of uptick. Still, Johnston says she just doesn't like what she's been hearing lately. I love living in our little town, but this is getting ridiculous, really scary. And that now this attack on her husband banged up, beat up, is the most shocking. In Cascade Locks, Audrey Wheel, Fox 12, Oregon.